Got another GE washer that is blinking no matter what setting we go to. And when we press something, it just starts blinking and never really does anything. It tries to come on. Now we could go through trouble codes and air codes and all of that. If you haven't seen my other video on when the lights blink, check that out. But I got a pretty good idea of what this is. So let's jump right in. Two slots right here hold in this front plate. We're gonna have to do this to access the lid switch. Just kind of got one right there. You can see the latch right there where it goes in. Get this lid out of the, get this cover out of the way. Now, if we look up here, there's our problem bare wire, the lid switch. This is your lid lock. That's like the lid switch mechanism or whatever it is, but that broke. And these usually break from the drum wobbling too much. Everything looks like it's still intact. Sometimes these plastic pieces break, causing it to go crazy when it wobbles, but other times it's just a uh, overloading it so let's swap this out real quick i also encourage you whenever working on any kind of appliance to track down the service tech sheet this one is right behind this panel right here and it will tell you how to get into service mode how to look up the air codes and how to clear the air codes and all that good stuff this one has definitely seen better days. Unplug the power to the washing machine. Lift up the lid. With the screwdriver pushing this tab. As you can see it clicked and then you should be able to push up on the lid switch. Pull out the lid switch. Yeah that's a nice break. Nice clean break right there. We've got our new lid switch right here. I'm gonna go ahead and cut. Gonna match the colors when we wire nut these together. Go ahead and push this back in. Wires on the Face in the back, there's a lip right here. That lip sits in there and that pushes down. I'm gonna add some protection to these wires right here. Pretty much I'm just gonna electrical tape them. Just clean that up a little bit because I don't want the drum hitting those wires again. We apply power to the washing machine. Entering service mode. Hold down start and fabric softener for three seconds. Then we're gonna move the dial to position six. Lights are gonna blink. From there, we're gonna go to position four, hit start to clear all air codes. And this can all be seen in the service tech sheet. We're gonna hold start and fabric again for three seconds and move to position six to get out of it. I'm gonna run a quick, quick rinse and check our repair. And now we're draining. If this helps some of y'all out, go ahead and hit that like button. But that's it for me today. Hope to see you on the next fix.